Go, don't play with it, don't be the size. Hey, still not understand. Was taken from me when she was eight. Her father and her stepmother filed for her to go and live with her in America from she's eight years old. She's 12 now, and she came to Jamaica to spend the summer holiday with me. While she was here in the summer holiday, I was talking about my problem, what my father has done to me. See my little baby crying, then I asked her, why are you crying? It's not about you, it's about me. This is what my baby said to me. When I was nine years old, three months after, my father started to kiss me on my mouth. And then, as going on, he said, if I told anyone, you'll get taken away, and I'll get taken away and told my stepmother, and that it was father and daughter love. Then he started to put his finger in my vagina, and then he started to put his face in my vagina. Then when I was 11 years old, he put on a condom, and he stick his penis inside of me, and I told him it hurts, and then he took it out. And then as that, he went on like nothing ever happen happened. And then when I'm taking showers or anything, he'll ask me if I, he wanted me to wash my back. And I told him, okay. And then he came in the shower or he was outside of the shower. He'll wash my back. But then after, he'll put his finger where my vagina was. And then my brother which is 20 odd years old, started to molest me in my sleep. He came to visit a day and then he would sleep in my bed because there wasn't any other bed in the house. And at night, he would touch me in my sleep and he told me I can't tell anyone. So I thought it was brother and daughter love, like how my father said. And then, yeah. You come to Jamaica. And then I came to Jamaica and then I told my mother about it about it okay and she told me about it i called them and when i called the stepmother she told me yes stephanie did tell her about the brother that is theodore arters right mm -hmm. and she said she apologized to stephanie apologize doesn't help my baby that's why she never tell princess arters about the father because she said they do nothing when the brother is my daughter with his finger in her sleep they did nothing about it. So she feel like she come to Jamaica for the summer, she tell me. Now she tell me, I call them. They blocked us. He's here in Jamaica currently with her green card. I don't know how my daughter is going to go to school. She's out of the system here cleaning Jamaica because she get filed for her. American tell me I have to get her back in the country for them to have a case because they don't have a case if she's not there. Jamaica tell me they can't do nothing because... The crime doesn't happen here. While her father is here in Jamaica and he's holding on my daughter's green card. Holding on my daughter's green card, that means she can't go back to America to press charge on him. This is the reason why I have to go to social media. Because I want to know where I'm going to get the help from for my daughter to go back to school and to press charge on her father who is a pedophile. Not even her father alone. The father and the brother. Who is Richard Arters and Theodore Arters. And she is Stephanie Arters and she's... 12 years old, she's a minor, and then being sexually assaulted, my daughter, for she's 9 year old, and telling my baby she should take that to her grave. What grave she should take that to? She's a child. My baby is a kid. She don't know what he was doing to her, telling her that his father love. What kind of father put on condom on his daughter and go on top of her? That is what I want them to tell me today, tomorrow, any day, because I'm not going to stop until I get justice for my daughter was taken from me when she